guys, I'm happy to have you with me once again. We have talked about the sun and its eight planets in our lesson on the planets of our solar system. Do you still remember the difference between the terrestrial planets and the Jovian planets? If you do, then cool. In this lesson, we'll talk about three interesting orbital objects, asteroids, comets, and meteors. We'll also talk about the circular region where they move around, commonly known as belts. Between the orbit of Mars and the orbit of Jupiter is the asteroid belt. This is the home of asteroids. Asteroids are leftover pieces of the solar system that formed at the time when the solar system was formed, that is 4.6 billion years ago. Asteroids are rocky and also have pieces of metals in them. They orbit around the sun and can also have their own moons, but they are not planets because they are too small to be called planets. They do not have a spherical shape, rather, they are quite irregularly shaped and dented. Another belt that moves around in the solar system is the Kuiper belt. This one has a larger orbit and is believed to be the home of many comets. Comets are also leftover pieces of the solar system, but are mostly made out of frozen gases, ice, and dust particles. Comets sometimes leave their orbit and fly close to the sun. When this happens, they begin to melt and look like stars with fiery tails and have a lovely hue. The comets are beautiful, and you'll be lucky to see one in your lifetime, as they are very rare. Sometimes, the remains of the dust particles from comets fall on planet Earth. This is what we call meteors. You probably know them as shooting stars. A meteor ranges in size. They could be the size of dust particles or as large as boulders. Next time you're stargazing, look out for a shooting star or a comet and be sure to make a wish. I'll see you in the next lesson.